Now we're gonna harvest the dry and the camis. So these are peers and we only have four rows and a little bit more in the other fields. It's also everything we need for our market, but it adds up to the variety for customers to choose what they like. So these don't hang too full this year, but still there's enough for us. And we also have a lot of damage here from insects. So as you can see here, this one is damaged. And that's because a wasp or something tried to eat it and damaged it. So that's quite a shame. But that's how that goes. So I'm not gonna drop it. The pickers will drop it, otherwise the other peers will drop as well. So let's get the plug tracks over and start harvesting here. So we got great Dwayne Camis this year. They are really big and we also get a nice amount of bins. It's not like top production, but it's a nice amount, so that should be good. It's just a challenge to sell them all. A lot of people love the Dwayne Camis because they get really sweet if you let them play around for a while until they get a bit soft. Of course, we don't pick them that ripe because we cannot store them anymore then. But if you lay them in the kitchen for a few days, not in the fridge, then they get really nice and sweet. And that's how a Dwayne Camis has to taste. Well, it's good that we have the duels today. We are having rain again and we are on heavy clay. So it means we really need all the traction we can get. And the duels, they are really helping us in doing that. It's not ideal for picking as they are quite in the way. But if it helps to get the machines through, then we have to go for it. As a machine that has to be pushed is worse than having some issues with the bin exchange to do it fast. We are sacrificing a few seconds on the bin exchange to be able to actually drive the machines through the field and they don't seem to, to leave a heavy trail at this moment so that's really good. 
biggest issue with Diana Camis is they get eaten by insects a lot. As you can see here, this one is eaten and it's not by a bird, but it's by insects. So mostly wasps are trying to eat these, but also earworms are trying to eat them. And it's just because these peers are so soft, they actually manage to eat them. With a conference peer, this is not possible as the, it just is way too hard and the insect cannot bite it. But with the Dwayne Camis, they get in there and they just start eating holes in them and that makes them worthless. So we have to throw this one away. Which is a shame of course, but that's the big challenge with Dwayne Camis.
you can also notice that the driving lane here is seeing quite black but it isn't destroyed or anything so that's good it's just a bit ripped up but there's no deeper tracks than this and that's actually a good thing so it's just not green anymore and if we give it about a week or two and some rain and some good weather then this will look perfect again and we got a straight driving lane still if we would have driven with uh, single tires on the plucker track then I think it would have been a lot worse as the machines have to pull the trailers forward and this is actually really heavy clay soil here that means they really dig up the ground if they have to pull something here it's also with the tractor we just have to drive really slow to not destroy the ground so we finished picking the dry and the chemis and we got a nice amount of bins out of here it's not too much production isn't that high of this orca but still it's enough for what we need we also lose a lot of kilos on the ground as you can see and that's all due to the insects which are eating the piers so they get damaged and there's things you can do to prevent that but since we only have four rows it doesn't really make sense to make a big job out of that so we just leave it as it is and this is just what we produce And we got a beautiful load of the and the chemise. If you enjoyed this video, then don't forget to like, share and subscribe so you get a notification when the next video comes online. It's harvest time, so a lot more videos will follow. Thank you for watching.